Hello and welcome back. In our last episode, we just won a couple of costly victories. And our army size is really depleted now. But we definitely need a lot of infantry units. But we can't really recruit anything except for Town Watch. I will recruit one Town Watch. And it's going to take some time to get reinforcements on the way. So... Let's go ahead. I'm not. I'm gonna recruit some town watch, just so they can stay in the barracks. And we'll just go ahead and send some reinforcements. We still have Spain to watch out for, but it's just three units, so we don't really need to worry about them too much. Let's get some reinforcements on the road. And yeah, so most of this army will go ahead and be sent to be reinforcements. Let's get... We do want to have a couple of guys uh, just to protect our homelands. Merge this group. Send these guys in here as part of the reinforcements. And we'll just uh, and we'll go ahead and recruit that. Make sure we recruit everything. Alright, let's end our turn. So we've got a new general here, Marcus Julius. He's got nothing. He's got no traits whatsoever. whatsoever. And Decius Julius just got a tax farmer, which lowers his influence but gives him a bonus to taxes. Let's just keep an eye on him. Secret. Let's wait one more turn before we move out. Alright, over here in Segesta, I'm going to build I'm going to build a market. I'm going to go ahead and send a couple more guys for reinforcements. And we'll just move some cavalry into our capital. We do want to keep some people here, so just in case to fight off more rebellions or whatever. Let's get a Velites in this group as well. Alright, we got our new general. He's going to head out to the Orders. frontiers as well. Hey. He's going to lead this this army. All right, next turn. Okay, it looks like Spain is moving quite a big army in to our territories. I'm not sure what they're planning. So, I think I'm going to have to leave my faction leader here. Although I'm going to go send him out and see if we can hire some mercenaries. We'll go ahead and do that. Even though these guys are overpriced. We just need the manpower right now. Just in case these guys attack, which they probably will. How are we doing? We got three open slots. We can send... What do we, we want to balance. We want to make sure we have a balanced force here. Let's get our really weak guys and send them over to Masilla. Get these guys in here. We'll have pretty big stack here. And Spain's got tons of fleets here, too. What are they planning? Um, are they planning some sort of invasion? Let's get these guys. Let's hold up on our reinforcements in case they're planning on an attack. They may have guys on these ships here. So we'll just play it safe here. We'll put some guys into... Segesta and get this guy back into a retium. And we'll train more Hastati. Alright, what can we build here? We can get a temple to Bacchus. And this is where I want to build cavalry. And we want Velites. Send 
Another Velites on the way out. Get another Equites into our capital. So we should be set to defend ourselves in case Spain wants to attack. I'm going to go ahead and get a, a blacksmith here. Priest of Jupiter, that's really good. Plus one to every every trait. Build anything here. Should I get a barracks? Yeah, just that'll be fine. It'll be more than two turns before we can upgrade. Train any more guys over there. Yeah, now I'm kind of worried about Spain. They are up to something. But I think we're pretty well defended uh, in our homeland and in our frontiers. We'll just hold off a little bit. Give our cities some time to grow. We're getting our legion barracks in two turns. Yeah, we're just going to hold up a little bit. All right, let's end turn and see what Spain does, see what Gaul does. Yeah, there we go. I knew it was going to happen, as I predicted. We got Stoic Philosophy. That's pretty cool. Oh, we failed our mission. Maybe they'll give us an appropriate mission. Let's see if we can make peace with Gaul. And we'll take the war to Spain now. This should not be a big deal for my faction leader. But we got a pretty good army here. Let's go ahead and fight. We outnumber them quite a bit. Are these guys have bonus to cavalry? No, they don't. So, just light cavalry, warhounds, javelins. We'll have to watch out for their skirmishers. We have a lot of skirmishers ourselves. Let's go ahead and fight. We got two to one odds, so let's hopefully this is not another average victory. I don't know if I want to try to get out over here and do a move my guys around or if I'm gonna try to get out. Let's just send everybody out the front gates. So we'll have infantry here and then cavalry. We'll just sit over here in the corner and have our missiles. Go ahead and just spread them out all along here. All right, let's deploy. Let's get our infantry out as fast as we can. Double time. Wait, not just us, Dottie. We want everybody out. Double time. Get out the gates. Open the gates. We're sallying forth. Where are they going? <laughs> what is their general doing? Is their general on a suicide march? Let's get him. Well, their general's this running away. No That's good. To behave, but in battle, it's beyond belief. Infantry. Let's stay out of range of their skirmishers. Unit, move, Let's send our missiles up ahead. Unit, and send our keep our cavalry here. We already got their general to flee. Don't want to rush things too much. Don't want my guys to get winded. They're already kind of winded. So my archers are firing.
I'm gonna go ahead and send a charge here on their flanks. They're just skirmishers. They do have their light calf, so that is to be a little bit concerning, but I think I want to take care of this left wing here. We've got our infantry, our warband infantry, um, and our Hastati's taking on their light cavalry here. Let's get these guys to move up. Make sure we keep an eye on our general. Let's take out their light calf. Good. Calf. Nice. Alright. Let's go over here. We've got some town militia. Let's go ahead and uh, attack with our infantry. And just, yeah, let's get everybody here to attack. They're skirmishers. Okay, I think they're routed now. Or are they retreating? Let's get their Iberian in infantry. I think those are their most powerful guys. Well, they're not as good as our Hastati, but they're, I think, one of their best infantry so far that I've seen. Alright, they're fleeing. Okay, let's end the battle. Alright, that was a really good victory for us. We only lost 22 guys. We killed 522. We didn't wipe them out. They still have half their forces remaining, but it was a really, very good victory. And we got our Barbarian Cavalry some experience. So pretty decent victory for us. We can retrain some Town Watch. And they got another stack over here, very similar. A lot more uh, infantry this time. Let's go ahead and kill this uh, family member here. He's not very good at combat. So we'll go ahead and take... General. Let's get our faction leader some more experience. So what do we got? We just got probably heavy cav. And... Um, some skirmishers. So let's go ahead and get just a pretty small army going. Oh, he re retreated into the boats. So I'm going to go ahead and try to build up our navy just a little bit. And get our faction leader back into the city. Whoops. Get him back in the city so we can make money again. And I want to send a pretty sizable army out. So we'll get this guy on the, on the road. We're going to send some reinforcements. We don't have the naval power to launch a naval invasion against Spain. Um, where's my diplomat? Okay, he's already moved. So yeah, we'll try to do some reinforcing. Let's get these guys. Not, not him. Alright, let's get most of these guys on the road. We're going to merge with this guy. Definitely need some Velites too. We'll station him here. And train up some more Velites. 
We're getting some more navy. I'd like to be able to build the upgraded docks, but we're doing the heavy infantry here instead. Get an academy, that will give us better leaders. Alright, we'll do more. We'll do some velites over here too. I think we got plenty of equites. No barbarian cavalry. Alright, let's get these guys on the move. I think I'm going to disband my Triarii. How much is the upkeep? It's just 16. Uh, let's just keep them in here for public order. Could just retire these guys, because I'll never be able to retrain them. Well, not for a while, anyways. Wow, look at this guy. What's he doing here? He's trying to sneak around and attack with a full stack. Orders. Well, let's go ahead and meet him on. Orders. I'm gonna merge my guys. I'm just gonna leave two town watch here. That should be enough to keep the public order. Let's make sure. Yep. Let's go ahead and recruit another town watch. Imperator. It's warband. Light infantry. So he's actually got us out manned here. He's got way more troops than us. Uh, he's got more cavalry, more infantry. He's got his druids, which are very powerful. I'm thinking these guys are a little bit too tough for us. We just don't have enough infantry. I'm going to withdraw. They'll probably attack us next turn. Let's go ahead and reinforce with some town watch. So they probably won't be able to take this city next turn. You know, having them attack us will actually be better for us for defensive purposes. We need to have a diplomat in range. Unfortunately, we don't. Let's get military everywhere. We need to recruit and recruit and recruit. Um, they have so many ships. I think their boats are even better than ours. Fleet ready. Eight, seven, and seven, and their boats are six and six. So our boats are a little bit better. All right, let's uh, in turn. Gaul's probably going to attack us over here, but I hope, hopefully, we can defend it out, defend it because. Um, Blockade Palma. Um, maybe, maybe we can try and do that. Give a priority appointment. Okay, so they didn't attack us. They just went here. Can we do a ceasefire? Speak with them at once. Okay, they're not interested. Let's go ahead. We can get some more guys. I think um, we might be okay. We'll see. Where did the Spanish go? We'll continue to recruit. Uh, let's go ahead and take this boat out. And we can take this whole army out. Five to one. I think we can sink the boat. No. They're able to escape, unfortunately. Ready to sail. Merging with the fleet. Uh, they got a lot of small fleets. I will try to get to Palma. I can get there in three turns. Let's go ahead and yes, just Captain. build more fleets. We'll retrain these, get another guy. And I'm gonna get a boat here. Ooh, we could get Principes. I will do that instead. 
We'll get some Principes. We'll get some really good infantry. Orders. Send our guy out. Send our reinforcements. Oh, uh, do I have the strength to attack this? I don't think I do. I think I need to wait for reinforcements. I will take on this small army here. Actually, let him just retreat. Prepare for battle. Victory! And I'm going to set up defensively on this bridge. This city is going to get sacked, unfortunately. Imperator. But I, I just, uh, I don't think I have... I have big enough army, but with all my skirmishers, it's just not, it's not a... It's not a well-balanced army. It's just not a good army. The army composition is just not very strong. At your service. Moving. So there's their army. They're retreating. Guess they don't want to deal with the Gauls. We're about to lose a settlement. It's okay. Our capital is getting stronger and stronger. Uh, let's do an armorer. So let's get some really overpowered guys here. We get the armor upgrades. And over here, we need to go low taxes. We need to get this city upgraded as well. One thing's good is we do have a lot of money. I'm going to send these guys over here. They'll get retrained. Look at that. Can I build anything here? Yeah. What do I want to build? Do I want to upgrade my blacksmith? I think that's the best move right now. How's our finances? Are we losing money? Um, I think... Yeah, we are losing money. We're getting a lot of troops, but we kind of, we're kind of in a lot of battles here. We got the Spanish. I don't think I need that more Velites. I got enough Velites. Yeah, we might as well tax these guys as much as we can for one more turn before we lose the city. Unfortunately, we just don't have enough troops out here. We don't have enough good troops. We've got a lot, bunch of mediocre troops and too many uh, skirmishers. Not enough infantry. But we'll lose this city. We'll take them out next in a couple of turns. We've got reinforcements coming. We've got a lot of infantry, a lot of good cavalry. A couple of more, more skirmishers, which we really didn't need. Oh, we do got some rebels over here, which I will... Dispatch with Quintus. It'll have to wait a couple of turns, I think. They've got two Astatis, Velites, and probably cavalry, too. So we'll get Quintus to do that next turn. Alright, I'm going to end turn. And uh, we'll say goodbye to our Narbo Marti Narbo Martius. Oh, interesting. Oh no! Our faction leader died. Oh no! He was getting pretty old. Uh-oh, so we're dealing with barbarians and no leader. Let's get Decius. He's a useless assessor. Stern. Uh, I guess he'll lead the army. Well, that's, that's no good at all. Alright, what do we want? We want to get rid of 
these Velites. How many do we want? One, two, three Velites. And town watch. Let's keep one Velites. One more. Send them over there. Do I want two commanders, maybe? Get two commanders. That'll give us two decent cavalry. Definitely want to get my good Histalis, good Equites. Okay, we got one more. These guys, I, I think I can just... They've been good service, but we'll disband them. So we'll get... Commander, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, okay. And we'll get another commander. We'll have two generals in this army. Actually, what I can do is I can have two armies, one led by each of them. And we do have a lot of money, so we're going to hire some more mercenaries. Fortunately, let's see here. Masilla is getting pretty close to being able to expand. I think I'm going to disband a town watch. That'll give my population an extra 80 people. Get them to grow faster so I can get better units. Darryl. Let's Darryl. disband them. So, population will grow in a couple of turns and we'll be able to upgrade this city. Orders. Sir. We'll hold the bridge for now. Let's see if they want to make can peace. Ceasefire. We'll give them trade rights. We'll give them map information. And we don't want to demand. We'll give them. I don't know. How much do you think this is worth? 5,000? We've got a lot of money. I don't want to lose this town if I can't help it. Nope. Okay. Do I even want to bother building... Recruiting troops when I'm just going to lose this city next turn? Hopefully, like, Spain and Gaul get into a fight. That would be nice. But that's wishful thinking. I'm going to continue to build ships. And we got our good infantry. Let's send him and an Equites to reinforce. And we'll get him and him. Take out these rebels. Ooh, wow. These guys are actually pretty strong. They've got a rebel general who is a heavy cav. Uh, they got 25 guys. So let's go ahead and fight this battle. Give Quintus some more command experience. Uh, that'll help him out. Over there stand the rebel Alright, let's get... Let's put Quintus over here on the right front. Where are they? Of course, they're on the hills.
you gotta be really worried about these uh, these heavy cavalry over here. But we got them surrounded. Okay, make sure our general doesn't get hit. They're routing. All right, the enemy general is dead. Let's just mop them. Mop Army them up. is in flight. Pursue them and drive them from the battlefield. Well, it was a pretty good victory. Not the best. We lost 60 guys, but uh, not too bad. Hopefully, we can get another star for our general. Maybe we got another star. Good for Quintus and a veteran centurion. Nice. Let's get him back Orders. into the city. Leaving the army. Onward. Move depleted, sir. Orders, sir. General. These guys back. Forward. Very nice. I'm gonna send my Five. fleets out to Palma. Try to do that Senate mission. All right, we can finally build the governor's palace here in uh, Patvium. Let's go ahead and raise taxes. And I'm going to train some Hastati. People are kind of unhappy here, but we'll, I think we'll be okay with 75% public order. Uh, let's get some more equites. And we can upgrade these guys, get some more equities. We'll go ahead and get that, and I'm going to lower the taxes here too. Try to get our population to go faster. Here's fine. How about over here? We s we're at low taxes. We should... Yeah, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to cut that. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of another town watch here. We'll get the uh, governor's villa here. We can raise the taxes and recruit another town watch, just like that. So even though we drop below the 2,000 population, because we already got this queued up in construction, means we can go ahead and keep building it, and we can recruit that town watch back. It costs us a little money, but get this town to grow a little bit faster so that we can start producing better units here closer to the front lines because... Um, we're in the thick of it with Gaul. Alright, so Lucius Julius is our new faction leader. He's really good management, and he's gotten pretty good um, command. His command is pretty decent. So hopefully these guys can uh, develop some command traits out here on the front lines, battling with the calls. And then we'll take Parma, which is Carthage. Uh, we'll blockade it. I hate to declare war on another faction, considering how many wars we have right now. But let's go ahead and end our turn. 1 to 25 strength. We have nobody really defending this place. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and fight it out and maybe we can get kill his general or kill some enemies. Take up the shield. Grasp the spear. Sharpen the sword's edge. This is a day of destiny and fate of many will be decided in this place. These goals do not need your fear. Cold steel will bring them down just like any other man. They seem keen to throw their lives away in an assault. Well, it would only be polite to send them to the afterlife. We are hugely outnumbered. So if today we die, we do so as heroes, defiant in the face of all odds. I have never lost a battle against the <laughs> He's people. never lost a battle. Why should I start losing now with men such as you at my command? Another victory is at hand. We go now to our bloody business. 
Oh, that was a good speech from an unknown general who's about to die. So let's go ahead and uh, get these guys set up at the gates here. And, and hopefully we can get some kills. That's all we can ask for in this battle. Looks like they're breaking the gates in multiple locations. We do have our towers. They can do some damage. I'm wondering. They, they got a lot of their cavalry in the back, so I can't just do some sort of sneak attack on their general. I wish I could just open the gates, let them in. So let's get this. We'll focus on getting our guys here. I don't see they do have skirmishers, so we'll keep them back. We'll put all of our defenders over here. No, no, no. Go this way. Actually, you know what? We'll we'll take the hills. We'll defend the hills. We'll probably get surrounded. What are you doing? Wow, that was quick. Let's go ahead and defend this gate here. Yeah, our walls have been collapsed. We're about to get overrun. Get in here. Oh, they got druids. Those druids are deadly. Let's try to kill some druids. I don't know. We're about to get destroyed by druids. Maybe we can kill one. <laughs> druids are really powerful. Yeah, we had no chance. We didn't kill one guy. Well, according to this, it says we killed 65. Most of them were from our watchtower, so we got the better of them. But, pretty hopeless situation. But, we got our reinforcements in, and we'll take them back soon. Okay, we got Patvium unhappy. Let's get some Hastati. And get more of our elite infantry over here, the Principes. I'm gonna get... Can we get some reinforcements over here in Patvium? So we can raise the taxes, get more money. And more rebels here. More naked fanatics. And we've got a large Spanish army and a large Gallic army. I'm gonna. And then looks like Britain's attacking us too. Everyone's attacking us at the same time. Well, and now we're gonna go to war with. Carthage? What are these guys doing? The Spanish Navy's going after them? Let's get this uh, general, this Navy defended. We'll retrain these guys up. I don't know if I'm going to recruit. I'm not going to recruit anybody because I want to get to the next population level. In fact, do I have some town watch I can disband? And 3% of 6,000. That is quite a bit. Let's get rid of some more. Um, will we get that next turn? Yes, I think we will. We'll at least be close enough if we disband another town watch. Okay. Another group of naked fanatics. Let's go ahead and just take them out. Merging armies. General. 
and they do have heavy cav. Let me send one more hostility. Imperator. Attack! All right, we got two to one odds. These naked fanatics are pretty decent, actually. They don't have good defense, but they have good attack. All right, let's go ahead and fight this. This little rebellion. Portents. Alright, we're going to fire at will. We'll try to flank him with our cavalry. Send our cavalry down here. These guys up. Group, group I'm gonna have these guys Go run. Units, units, move, move. We'll take out their General first. Let's go ahead and hit their general. I'll send one cav to make these guys nervous. The enemy general flees. Press four. Yeah, let their general flee. We'll hit their cavalry in the rear. And our heavy uh, infantry over here. Let's go ahead and hit this guy. These guys will go ahead and hit these fanatics. These guys will hold firm. These guys will also hold firm. And we'll hit this guy. Like, no, we'll do that. So the spirit of his army is broken too. Wow, their naked fanatics just overran our uh, elite uh, heavy infantry. That's no good. Wow. So we've lost quite a bit of guys. The gods be praised! The enemy's hearts are full of fear and now they flee! All right, well, we're mopping up these guys now. Well, we only lost 73 guys, however, we lost a lot of our elite uh, principes here. It's uh, not an ideal um, result for us. I didn't really expect those naked fanatics to be able to do quite so much damage. We'll get our general back in here. And this is going to delay our reinforcements because I want to send these guys back to be retrained. Um, we can uh, send our equities on. We can send these guys as reinforcements. But I think I want to go and get these guys retrained. Retrain these guys here. I really want to hurry up and upgrade this so I can get some archers. I'm going to go ahead and send these uh, Hastati back here. Forward. No more moves, sir. 
All right, I'm going to go ahead and put a cut in it here. In our next episode, we'll continue the fight on the frontiers. Looks like we're about to get into war with Britain as well as Spain and the Gauls. But we will keep pressing. And maybe the Gauls can can't, will accept ceasefire now. Um, let's give them some money. And so we only have to fight two two factions? Nope. It's like they want to keep on fighting. But we'll just continue to build up our forces. And our home provinces. We're going to have to deal with money pretty soon. Um, unfortunately, our allies aren't doing too well either. Well, anyways, I want to put a cut in here. Thanks for watching. Bye.